How to successfully crate train your Pembroke Welsh Corgi. Are you a proud owner of a Pembroke Welsh Corgi? These little bundles of energy are known for their intelligence and playful nature. However, like any other dog breed, it is important to properly train them to ensure they become well-behaved members of your family. One of the key aspects of training a Corgi is crate training. In this video, we will guide you on how to crate train your Pembroke Welsh Corgi effectively. Why crate training is important. Crate training has numerous benefits which make it an essential part of your Corgi's overall training. Firstly, it provides a safe and secure space for your dog. Dogs are den animals by nature, and having a crate that serves as their den gives them a sense of security and comfort. Additionally, crate training helps in potty training your corgi. Dogs naturally avoid soiling their sleeping area, so having them in a crate encourages them to hold their bladder until they are outside. Lastly, crate training aids in preventing destructive behavior when you are unable to supervise your furry friend. It creates a confined space where they can have a safe and controlled environment. Choosing the right crate. The first step to successful crate training is finding the right crate for your Pembroke Welsh Corgi. The crate should be big enough for your dog to stand, turn around, and lie down comfortably. However, it shouldn't be too big either, as dogs tend to avoid soiling their sleeping area. The ideal crate should feel cozy and secure, with enough ventilation. There are different types of crates available, such as wire crates, plastic crates, and soft-sided crates. Each has its own advantages and disadvantages, so choose the one that suits your corgi's needs and your personal preferences. Introducing the crate. Once you have selected the perfect crate, it's time to introduce it to your corgi. Start by placing the crate in a common area of your home, where your dog can easily see and smell it. Make the crate inviting by placing soft bedding, toys, and treats inside. Leave the crate door open and allow your corgi to explore the crate at their own pace. Encourage them with positive reinforcement and praise when they show interest in the crate. Avoid forcing your dog or shutting them in the crate initially, as this may create a negative association with the crate. Feeding and positive reinforcement. To further associate the crate with positive experiences, try feeding your corgi their meals inside the crate. Begin by placing the food bowl near the crate and gradually move it closer to the crate's entrance until your dog is comfortable eating their meals inside the crate. This helps them build positive associations with the crate as a place for relaxation and enjoyment. Additionally, use positive reinforcement techniques such as treats, praise, and toys to reward your corgi when they voluntarily enter the crate or remain calm inside it. This will reinforce their good behavior and make them more inclined to view the crate as a safe and comfortable space. Gradual Crate Training Crate training should be done gradually over a period of time. Start by closing the crate door for short intervals while your corgi is inside and gradually increase the time as they become more comfortable. Be patient and do not rush the process, as each dog learns at their own pace. Provide your dog with engaging toys or puzzle feeders to keep them occupied while in the crate. Additionally, make sure to take your corgi outside for regular bathroom breaks to prevent accidents and reinforce their potty training. Avoid using the crate as punishment. It is crucial to avoid using the crate as a form of punishment. The crate should always be associated with positive experiences and should never be used as a means to discipline your corgi. Using the crate as a punishment can lead to anxiety, fear, and can even reverse the progress made in crate training. Remember, the crate is a safe haven for your corgi, and it should remain a positive and comfortable space for them. Troubleshooting Crate Training Issues In some cases, you may encounter challenges during the crate training process. Your corgi may show signs of anxiety or reluctance to enter the crate. If this occurs, try using treats or favorite toys to lure them in, or place a piece of clothing with your scent on it inside the crate to provide comfort. If your corgi continues to struggle with crate training, consider seeking guidance from a professional dog trainer who can help you address any behavioral issues. Conclusion Crate training your Pembroke Welsh Corgi is an important aspect of their overall training and development. By providing them with a safe and secure space, 
you can teach them important house manners, prevent destructive behavior, and aid in potty training. Remember to choose the right crate, introduce it gradually, use positive reinforcement, and avoid using the crate as punishment. With patience and consistency, your corgi will soon learn to love their crate and view it as their cozy den.